Welcome to Red Dead Redemption 2. I've added over 100 mods in order to turn this into Undead Nightmare 2. This is Arthur Morgan. He's a pelt trapper and hunter by trade, but as the years went on, pelts have been excessively hard to come by. So Arthur has opted to expand his horizons a bit. With his unique zombie killing skills, he now does odd jobs that nobody else will do. He's accompanied by his new friend Barry, who happens to be a zombified bear. Damn. These two have been mowing down zombies, and Arthur knows that's one pelt he will not skin. He's also joined by his gallant steed, although now zombified as well. This horse never lets him down. Today, Arthur has been contracted to clear out a farm that has been infested with zombies. Now, this farm is far out in the boondocks, but Arthur has to do what he has to do in order to make ends meet. Arthur's made it most of the journey there, so now we must follow this snowy path from here all the way to the zombie infested farm to clear it out. So Arthur Morgan continues riding down the path, clearing out any zombies he sees straggling about. With Barry right behind him, there's no way this contract could go sideways, or at least hopefully not. The farther up north we go though, the deeper the snow and the colder the weather. I think it's a good thing the horse is now a zombie, because now it can't feel a thing. Arthur Morgan finally makes it to the outskirts of the farm, and is quickly surrounded by a horde of zombies that dashed in from the woods. Damn. Ain't no problem for Arthur though. He took out the machete and started making zombie steaks. Damn, that actually sounds kind of good. Barry had his back as always, but as you know, these zombies like to hit Arthur Morgan from the back. Damn. Barry was going to Pound Town, and with a couple quick shots, that small pack of zombies was dealt with. Now we had to clear out the farm. From the outside, it didn't look like there were too many zombies to handle, which was good. Arthur was trying to get out the snow as soon as possible, so it was time to pounce. Arthur Morgan hopped on his horse and came in blazing with some headshots using the shiny Bugatti. This was the rootinest tootinest cowboy in the wild wild west of course, but he was also versed with a bow. He started lodging arrows in these zombies heads, and then he started shooting his shot until he got smacked in the back of the head. Damn. It was now time to get a little hands on, so Arthur Morgan brought out his fist. He started serving knuckle sandwiches, but these zombies had those salami slaps. Arthur Morgan's had worse though, so he knocked all of them out. Damn. Arthur Morgan brought out the shoddy Bugatti one last time, and for now it seemed quiet. Hopefully the job was done. We picked up our hat and then proceeded to search around the farm to see if there were any leftovers. Everything seemed clear, except for two zombies running in from the forest. Arthur Morgan quickly dealt with these fools, and it was a mission well done. It was time to hightail it out of there and go collect another contract. This wasn't the end of Arthur Morgan's pelt trapping ways, and his zombie adventure would continue. Damn.